Okay, this is CJ and MP here. Um, this we don't normally do tutorials. We might start, but um, this is just a tutorial on how to clone yourself in iMovie 09. Um, I don't know about iMovie 08 or anything. So first, what you're gonna do, you're gonna have your clip here. So there, and then. And then you you might want to exit a screen. You you can. You don't have to. Um, I did here. So I have this here. And um, actually, when you take, and then you'll take your second clip. Or and that's the answer to the question or whatever, or the question, and then this one's the answer. So you'll take this and you'll just place it anywhere. Then my computer's in French, so as you can see, everything's in French. But you click green screen, and see how it's all blurry here? Like, really, really bad. Sometimes it won't be as bad, like here, but, like, you can really tell. So, um, that's just, you got the order of them wrong. Like, here, it's on, this one's on the top. This one here is on the top instead of this one and they should be switched around you don't know the order until you try so it's kind of a trial and error so and that was my trial and error so then so you select your clip the other one and then you'll place it there and then you'll take your other one and I think it's to do with how dark it is um too like here it's really dark on this side, so you'll probably want to put your brighter clip there first. It's because I changed the lighting. But you always want, you have to have the same background. So don't change your camera at all. Like, see, this is all same angle. Just different brightness. So then you put that there, and then you click green screen. And then you have this, and see, it's still blurry. Um, so what you'll want to do is double click on that and then go video actually before that you'll want to crop and these four dots will appear and um you might want to put them on something not very noticeable like as you can see in the back i have my uh little board that i put posters and stuff on and uh so yeah so you put I put it on there so that it looks so that you don't notice it as much like see it kind of looks more natural and so that but then it's still blurry and stuff so you'll double click go to video and then you'll put it brighter add some red blue just kind of play with the colors until you're happy um, as you can see you don't you probably don't want it pink Unless, well, that's the point of your video or something. But so yeah, so you put that and see if you add all the green, you disappear and it's it really doesn't look good. But if you and if you take it all away, you end up with pink. So you want to leave it at a hundred percent. You just want to leave the green where it is. Um, and then so you just kind of play with the colors until you like it. You can move that around. And then um. Yeah, and so then you'll click done, and done, and so see how it looks kind of normal, but then here, see I randomly appear, so you'll want to delete that, but first, you'll play it, okay, so conveniently that was placed exactly perfectly, but Normally, you'll have to move this around to get it so when you're talking, it seems like you're both there at the same time. And then you'll want to delete the part that nothing's happening. So this is what it should look like. And so that's how you do it. You don't. I have no green screen there, just so you know. Like as you can see, no green screen, anything. And so yeah, so you can just do that. And here I'll watch it in full screen. But now 
Sebastian Pietze. Schöne Frage. So yeah, that is how you clone yourself in iMovie 09. And this has been a CJNMP tutorial. Thanks. Please subscribe too.